it is time to decorate for Halloween. <laughs> it worked out a lot better in my head than it did in real life. Oh, hey, Beans. I didn't know you were in there. You ready to decorate? Hi. Yes. Hello. If you're new here, my name's Ashley, and if you're a returner, welcome back. You may know this as the studio that I film in on the main channel, also known as our attic in the house. Honestly, behind you is like our Christmas decor, some DVD boxes, HVAC unit, ah! that I get to redecorate the studio for Halloween. Now, if you don't know what all this is, it is members of the Hot Mess Express, just some of you guys who are super thoughtful that like to send me things that you make or stuff that means a whole lot to you or you make or you make or you find because I love Richard Dreyfuss. Funko Pops for movies that I've watched and I like to switch things out occasionally or I'll add things every month after my monthly unboxing but today we're getting ready for Hello Beans. So all this has got to go. First things first is, I don't really know. You wanna scratch off these movie posters? If I touch a spider, I'm gonna scream. Robocop, Ferris Bueller's Day Off, The Never Ending Story. Oh fuck, I broke a nail. The Blues Brothers, Big, A Fish Called Wanda, Labyrinth. Is this how you're gonna help me, Beans? What did you do? Three hours later. I just got back from Walmart because I needed another bin to put all this stuff in. Um, update, found a spider. I just gave it a little love tap. I'm gonna have to scrub that wall off. That spider left a mark. All right, step one done. Now let's sweep this nasty cat hair and clean off the shelves. If y'all remember the saga with these shelves, I'm kind of nervous. Oh my God, fuck me in the ass. I was gonna say it as a joke, but it really happened. Uh, As long as I don't put anything heavy on it, it'll be fine. I gotta clean off where I power hug that spider. And also, if you're wondering why I have this ball of cat hair down here, it's because I was gonna film a TikTok and then I never did. If I did it by the time this goes live, I'll insert it here. Editing Ashley here to let you know that I never made the TikTok. I feel like a little gremlin. I don't think I've cleaned in here since I moved into this space. So like eight months. That's good. While I'm here, I might as well just go ahead. I could get the Swiffer or like the mop or something, but no. Woo, this is too small of a space for this much light, so I'm getting like a high. I know that sounded like a fart, but that was actually my ankle popping. Hold on, I can do it again. Did y'all hear it? Hold on. Y'all heard it? This is the cleanest this little attic has ever been. Well, this space. This whole box. Is strictly Halloween stuff. Anything scary, anything spooky, anything 
Halloween related is in here. We all can't really see much of you out there. Come on, get in here. It's so nice of you to come in here and join me. Let's see what we got. I'm at this weird stage where like my hair, I love my long hair, but it gets caught in my armpits and in the car door and it's too heavy to keep up in a bun. It gives me a headache, but I don't like it down because it gets in the way. First world problems. All right, let's decorate. Not really spooky, but fun. Where do I even start? I'm not totally sure where I should put this guy. I have like a whole exorcism shelf, that's so funny. Oh, our friend Alan sent me a picture of his greetings to Awkward Ashley poster at the steps of the exorcist. So, <laughs> that's going up here with the, oh, sorry, what if it, that's going up here on the exorcist shelf. Gremlin. Is it Christmas? Is it Halloween? Either way, it fits the theme. Like, does someone want to tell me how I forgot about Stay Puff Man? Oh, perfect. Harold the Drinky Bird might not be scary, but he has a permanent place in the studio, so he's got to he's got to be here. I gotta find a couple more things, and I'm, uh, I think it's in one of these boxes. BRB. OMG, just like I have an exorcist shelf, I'm about to have Freddy Krueger shelf. And for those of you wondering, it says, I'm your boyfriend now, Ashley. Happy birthday, Freddy K. From Robert England. Bleeding Green got me this for my birthday. Now hold on, Michael Myers needs to go by Linda. Oh my god, I didn't even see his little knife. This one is also from Bleeding Green and it says Mistakes in Life. Flashing your boobs to Michael Myers would rank right up there as a big one. So these two need to be together. Let's rearrange. Oh yeah, this would be perfect. And we can even put Winifred back. We got Freddy K, Exorcist with a gremlin. And then we got Michael Myers with Winifred Sanderson. I think that's everything. Hold on, where do I put these? At the time I'm filming this, this is it. I have an unboxing coming up in a couple days and there might be some more spooky stuff in there, but I don't know for sure. Where do I put the I Smell Children? But where does Harold the Drinky Bird go? Well, I'll put him right here. He won't be able to drink anything, but he's still probably family, so that's good. We got Bates Motel still up there, Queen Bean herself. All right, I think the redecoration for Hallow Beans is done. As of right now, we'll see what happens for the next unboxing. But thanks for watching the redecoration and I hope you join me on the main channel for the actual Hallow Beans series. Three uploads a week, scary movies done in night vision and it's just me, you, and the movie, okay? So, like, subscribe, stick around. I'll see you right back here for some more shenanigans and I'll see you on the main channel for Hallow Beans.